All right, since it's a Friday, we thought it would be best to end the show with one of the most popular music artists in the world. South African-born Master KG has people around the world dancing to his hit track, Jerusalem. It has 47 million views on YouTube and is growing steadily. So take a look at this dance. All right, now, most of us have tried it, and if you haven't yet, best you get ready because we'll be giving it our best shot in a bit. We're so glad to have Master KG in studio, and the majestic vocalist you're hearing on this track, Nom Nebo Zikode. We'll practice social distancing, of course. I'm going to walk over right now so we can actually do this. And by the way, guys, we're going to get uh, Sally Vedette to, to actually do this dance with us a little later. But thank you guys so much for joining us. Thank you so much for having Appreciate us. Appreciate it. Thank you. I can't believe it. In 2019, I went to Durban. I went home. Yeah. This was the only song my family was playing, right? And yeah. that's how I learned it. But now the whole world is dancing to it. First, just tell us how you feel that you're making people feel happy during a time of COVID-19. It's so amazing, um, like to see all those families enjoying this dance at home, um, together, dancing together from kids uh, to, to their parents, uh, like everybody. It's, it's, so, like, it's so nice to see, you know, I, I, like sometimes I feel like, you know, just emotional when I'm seeing everybody, you know, showing love to this dance, to this song. It's so beautiful to see. Yeah. So that's your voice. I mean, you know, I love your voice, by the way. Thank you so much. It's my much. alarm in the morning. Oh, just thank so you. Know. you. <laughs> I mean, you are making waves across the world. Your voice is echoing through the streets of London, the United States, Africa as a whole. Mm. How do you feel? I feel very, very blessed. Um, all the time when I wake up, I, I feel like pinching myself. Yeah. It's real. What's going on? But then I've been praying for... Uh, such a song so I think God has answered my prayers uh, I'm thankful to God I'm, I'm really bl blessed yeah. thank you so why is it so popular now Master KG by the way yeah. my uh, colleague and friend Slindelo said don't say Master KG because yeah. you'll be butchered she said I had to say Master KG <laughs> so uh, why did yeah. this become so popular this year around what do you think uh, is the reason uh, I think the reason is that um there, there, there was some vi there, there was a video actually that uh, I saw these other guys doing in it. Um, I think they're from Angola, but actually the dance actually originates from here in mm. SA. But then there's, there's a video that uh, went viral from from these guys from Angola. They were holding food plates, dancing, and then from there um, that video uh, it was just everywhere. So everyone just started also following that dance, doing the dance, and then. After all, I see everybody in the world is doing, it's going viral on TikTok, everywhere. I'm like, what's going on? What's going on here? And that time I was also like uh, thinking to make a remix, uh, the one featuring Banner Boy. So, and I also see while I was busy with the remix that there's, there's this thing that it's happening. Like the world are, are having a dance. There's a dance, everybody's having a good time. And it's so beautiful yeah. to see, yeah. So there are different versions, different languages. Spanish, I heard, I yes. saw... You should actually be singing those versions. Are you learning uh, other languages? I, yeah, I, I think you're right. Hey, I should learn one or two. Maybe I'll Spanish. Yeah. Who knows? Yeah, I think I yeah. should learn that. I think even them, they would love to hear me singing in their language. Yeah. yeah. So we watched the video of you uh, singing the song from last year. And, yes. I mean, your voice is really powerful. Thank you and so much. And I'm very surprised, and this is one of the things that I have an issue with, that I haven't heard from you outside of this song. So what are you doing to become a brand on your own outside of Master KG? Uh, <laughs> I mean, you might be that brand already. Yes. Yeah. Luckily, I'm signed uh, under Open Mic. Yeah. That's the same company uh, 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 that Master KG is signed with. So very soon, I'll, uh, I'll be releasing my own album uh, under Open Mic. 
uh, already there's my songs already on social media that are trending, like my single. Yeah. People, they know it's like, Tolumoya wamoya fesu gwenza gashe, ogo mshava kunge shul. Tolumoya wamoya fesu gwenza gashe, pilole ayikolula. So my people at home, trust yes. me, they know this song. They know it. Yeah, I, they are waiting I, for it already. I need to learn a bit more <laughs> clearly about this. So, yeah. uh, Master KG, of course, uh, yeah. you are, you know, locally, you weren't even nominated for Osama. Yeah. And we're not dissing anyone here. <laughs> but yeah. you're now on uh, the uh, Billboard charts in nationally yeah. which is huge for a local artist how do you feel about that it's so amazing um, it's one of those uh, moments whereby uh, it tries to show that like um, the people are the one who um, makes things happen you know like um, people might not recognize you but like uh, they, they're sitting there might be certain things that don't see your worth or what you're doing but the people are watching the people recognize your work everybody in the world is watching so like um, it's one of those moments that um, at times like this whereby we didn't even get a nomination. Um, things just turned, you know, uh, very nice. God just uh, created this beautiful side whereby people started even like, this dance just went even more and more viral by yeah. that time. So it shows that like uh, God is able that, um, um, you know, people are recognizing the work beside um, the awards not recognizing the work. You know? yeah. yeah. So you, of course, like everyone else in South Africa, we're in a lockdown. Yes. We're at home a lot. We're not allowed to interact a lot. We have to stand, mm. you know, like two meters apart, basically. How do you use this time to self-reflect, <laughs> to produce more music that is just as encouraging as this one? You know, I can't sit at home. If I can tell you, this guy <laughs> calls me now and then. Yeah. Hey, sister, get up. Are you sleeping? You should come to studios. So... All the time I go to Master KG, we do music together. If not that, maybe I'm at home with my kids. Yeah. Yeah. And what about you? What are you working on now? What do we look out for? Because listen, I know yeah. Skeleton Move was one of my other favorite songs. Yeah, yeah. I li so this is me, right? Let me, let me try to explain this so that people <laughs> understand me and how much I love local music. Yeah. I am playing it in my car all the time at mm. my house as well. So yeah. now during lockdown, we can't go out. Yeah. We can't really invite people over. Actually, we can't. So I record Skeleton Move just two weeks ago and send it to my group of friends and say, guys, yeah. we were out there dancing a couple of weeks ago to this song. Yeah. So what's your next project? Um, I'm, I'm going to drop a deluxe of, of the album, Jerusalem. This album that's out currently, Jerusalem album, I'm going to drop a deluxe of that album with more songs added so that I just keep people dancing. I have more beautiful songs that are coming soon. Also, I'm producing for my sister because also, you know, we just... This, this thing is working so beautiful for us together. So we just want to make even more, so we can make the world dance even more. Yeah. yeah. So um, can I be in your next song? <laughs> <laughs> can you sing? No. <laughs> okay, listen, listen. If of course it's Anna Damini Zuma can get a song from talking, yeah. <laughs> surely you can make a plan for me, right? Definitely, definitely. <laughs> yeah, anything definitely. is possible. But yeah. thank you so much for the great work, guys. I mean, you yeah. are keeping people happy during a period that's very difficult for all of us. You're super talented, both of you. Yeah. Yeah. You're making a news on a show that's generally talking about things that are very serious. Mm -hmm. uh, we're talking about very difficult periods in our country. Country and yeah. you got us all excited. I didn't sleep much night, uh, much last night because I was so excited about this interview. So we're going to get you guys to play for us. I'm going to call in Sally Vedette and Slinda Lomasekane. Okay. Sally Vedette is going to do this dance with us, guys. <laughs> and listen, we were here until 10 p.m. practicing. So come in, guys. Oh, my gosh. We are here until 10 p.m. practicing <laughs> this dance. Can't wait Try and to get see. it right. So people can be mean and tell us, oh, you guys are messing it up. But at least you're trying, right? I think right. I need to join you with this join one. Join us. Yes, <laughs> yes. Okay. We right might not be in sync. You know, our moves are better okay. compared to yours. So okay. you want to go ahead? Yeah, let's go. Let's I want go. to see right. you first, though. I'm going to be Instagramming as well because, you know, new times. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> we'll dance live. So let's, let's start it. Where do you start? Okay, okay, okay. Jerusalem, Ikayalami, Gilonolose, Uhambenami, Zumangishilana. Jerusalem, I can't 
with the show like this. We're live on Instagram as well. And that is Sally Bidet dancing, everyone. So thank you so much, guys. I appreciate it. Sally will have your headlines after she's done dancing at 6 o'clock. So take it away. Thanks so much for that. <laughs> 